Hi, everyone, and welcome back to the Introverts Corner. I'm Susan Scott Shelley. And I'm Chantel Mayer. And we, <laughs> we have a secret. We do. We have a secret. Yay. <laughs> We've had the secret for months now. Yeah, like at least six months. At least after. six months. Yeah. Yeah. It's been a while. <laughs> okay. So drum roll. We're writing together. We are. We are doing, well, actually, we're doing two series. <laughs> we are. Um, yeah, so let's, let's rewind back to the beginning. So we've been, and we had to like look this up because I feel like we've been friends forever. But, I, um, no. but then isn't it funny? It feels like we've known each other for forever and we've been friends for forever, yet when we were talking about it, I couldn't believe how long it's been. like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. It's so we've been critique partners for five years. That blew my mind. <laughs> yeah. And we've known each other longer than that, at least yeah. probably a couple of years longer than it, yeah. than yeah. that at least. So, um, and we also can't remember exactly how we became critique partners, oh. it, but that's, I, but this is, this is a thing though. I think with the two of us, it's, it's all been so organic. Has it, it? has been like, it just, yes. it just kind of happens. <laughs> like, so yeah, we've been critique partners for, for five years, yeah. um, multiple series that we've each written. Yeah. Um, and I think it was, so we've had our YouTube channel for over a year now, I Which, think. Yeah, I can't, yeah, yeah, yes, yes. Cause didn't we do our first one? Like it was the pumpkins, wasn't it? It was us carving pumpkins for the first time. Yes, yes, so that was, that was over a year ago. So, well, happy, happy belated birthday to, <laughs> birthday to us. If that worked really well inventing this channel together, which yeah. has been so much fun, just following our introvert adventures. <laughs> and we've said from the beginning with this, even with this channel that we wanted to do something together in addition to the channel, just something because we, we help each other so much with our, our plotting and character development in our, in our own stories. Right. And that just, it gels so well. It's yeah. like we, and we have so much fun. It's it's we have that is it the I fun. It was, yes, it was always such a fun process. Like yes, we yeah, and and you're right. We would like we just gelled and um I, like I always felt like I always felt like you knew my character. It, well, because you <laughs> you helped develop it. I mean, you know, like I just I always felt that's like yes knew my characters, <laughs> you know, as well if not better than I <laughs> than I did. Um, right, right, yeah. And I think we had offhandedly like said, oh, we should write. The first time we really tried to do, to well, share characters um, was again, like our second video on this channel when we so. did our gingerbread houses. The gingerbread houses, yeah, yeah, yeah. And so we, we had um, both of our characters were in each other's stories. There are, are many stories that we wrote that are on each of our blogs. So right. if you haven't seen them, head on over to our websites. Yeah. The links will be down below. Um, but that was fun, just having yeah. little bits of, you know, each other's worlds in our stories. And I think that really planted the seed of, okay, this could be something we actually sit down and and do as a, as, a, as an entire project. Right, right. And but And then, but we still didn't, yeah, like we we still hadn't really exactly talked seriously about it, and um, and you had graciously invited me to participate in the um, in the Bachelor Bid series, um, and so that was again it was you know we were working with RJ and Vicky and Jeff and um, created this world. Right. Um, and so, you know, that again, that was like, I guess, another, another right. tour. <laughs> it was. Some of us had each other's characters popping in, in our stories. And right. um, so it was, again, another taste of, okay, what would this be like to pick locations, agree on things, and be okay with writing about each other's characters a bit. Right. Right. Um, and that worked. And then again, 
more months went by September, 2020, why don't we just try a story together? And I think that just came out of our, so we've been doing weekly chats on Wednesdays and we talk about the, maybe a scene we've critiqued for each other, or we help each other plot or character development. And there are such fun conversations that I think we were just like, do this. Yeah. Yeah. Then the fun started because then it was like, okay. So I think Chantel, I think we both knew that we wanted to do Philly. Yes. And yeah. And you already had your series set here. Um, as, as did you. <laughs> right. As you're right. Exactly. So we already had series here. So I, for, I forgot about my books there for a minute. <laughs> See, this, is the, <laughs> this is how we work. Like, she reminds this is me how we work. Yes. Remind her of hers. <laughs> yes. So yeah. location checked. And then just. You know, I tend to do sports in my books in some way, whether it's a rec league or, or whatever, or prose. And um, I kind of wanted to continue that and let's do it. Let's do it. And and so, yeah, so we and we decided rugby because I'm I mean, so I'm not much of a sports person, but I have watched rugby and that is a fun sport to watch. <laughs> yeah. It yeah. is really like, it's really fun. And, you know, and not for nothing, but the individuals who play rugby are really f fabulous to watch. <laughs> <laughs> they have some lovely bodies. <laughs> <laughs> We thought it would be fun to just make it a rec league. We thought that, okay, let's, so if these guys come together to play rugby, how else do they know each other? Do they know each other outside of that? Um, what happens? Right. And that's the best question that we can ask is, okay, well, what's happening now? What's happening? Yeah, yeah. That was so fun. Was or, And it can that was, be fun. <laughs> so we should start to start by saying that it's, uh, it's a gay romance series. Yes. Should I just say the first three books? Yeah, yeah. It just makes me so happy that we have this in, entire... Um, universe created it's it's very yeah. cool yeah yeah so our two brothers are um finley and cameron they own a company with their sister aileen so yes siblings own this fun company um yeah and the first book focuses on finley and his love interest mateo um and mateo knows cameron because they yes they play rugby um, and the second book is focuses on Cameron and his love interest, Aspen, who also plays rugby awesome. on a different team. And that's, I can't wait till we get to that story, yeah. but, um, that one, there's an age difference. There's, yes. um, it's, it's about 10 years, right? Yeah. Um, and, and, uh, single dad, 10 years, like we've got, yeah. And then the third book involves um, Hercules, who is who plays rugby and happens to be Cam's Manny. And, yes. Um, and Apollo, who also plays rugby. Yes. Can just say that um, naming these guys was <laughs> the most fun and. Um... <laughs> If one of us had been reading about the Greek gods, you know, you'd never know. <laughs> from writing book one, other characters, side characters have kind of sprung to life. Yes. And um, as they are wont to do. <laughs> we have a character named Jalen yes. and Chantal was kind of like, you know, I think Jalen needs a book. Yeah. And I was just like, Sure. Yes, I agree. There is more to him than this little scene yeah. gives us. Well, um, this is yeah. so cool because so you wrote, you, you created Jalen. I mean, this is what's so fun too. Like, so, you know, we have, we have the, the books plotted out and, you know, we know what's going to happen. And, and um, so, you know, I write one scene, Susan. POV writes. character. And then, so we, we each took POV characters. Yes. And so Susan does the other. And so Susan wrote, wrote the scene and 
and she created this character, Jalen. And we don't see much of him, but this is what this is what you're so good at. This is one of the things that I, like I tell you all the time, and I know I've told you this for years, but I always have just, I love how we see, like how you make us want to know more about these side characters that honestly, Jalen could have just been a like, huh, a like you know just a kind of character to fill a, you know right. fill a, a purpose in that scene but yeah. I don't know I don't I mean, it's such a gift you have that you do oh, that thank you like create this where we were like yeah let's let's give Jalen let's give Jalen a book and then and then the world building began again because <laughs> Jalen spun off onto his own book which then turned into his turned into an entirely different series um and that one is um a more recent writing endeavor that we've we've taken on um in a funny twist of events that's the first book that's going to be coming out from from our, our our joint effort here so that one will be out in june as part of the charity uh, anthology we do for pride every year so i'm very very excited about that so the rugby guys are rec league rugby you know, they have regular jobs. The rugby is what they do on Saturdays. Jalen, let's just say he is involved in the hockey world. Yeah. Not a pro, but he plays hockey. And his love interest, Leaf, is a professional hockey player and he plays for the Philly team. Yeah. Uh, we first get the note of the Philly team in one of my books. And I knew I wanted to set a uh, hockey series in Philly. And I thought, what better way than to just incorporate that now with with our books, let's do this. Like we already know the coach, we already, you know, cause the coach is Vince's dad, Vince from book four in my series. So we already had it in place. It's just been a lot of fun. It um, and yeah. I think it's the back and forth. And like, again, like, we'll, it's so funny. Cause you know, like Susan will like, you know, I'll get a text from her. Like, what about this? Or I can see, you know, I can see this character doing this and, you know, and it's, yes. so, and like, I think that's, that's been one of the like great joy. Like, and we talk about how, like, you know, we're really in writing to entertain ourselves. <laughs> that's something we've done in our writing separately, like where right. Susan and I would be like plotting something or Susan might say something. And so like, I, or she might crack a joke or something. And so like, I might like, I'll put it in my story, like purely because it's like an inside joke between <laughs> the two yes. of us, you know, like, it's like that kind of, <laughs> it's that kind of thing. And so now I feel like we've kind of, we're kind of doing that on like a bigger scale. <laughs> like we are, you know, we are putting, you know, putting characters in and do, it's just, I don't know. It's been, it's been a lot of, it's a lot of fun and it continues to be fun. Yes. Um, yeah. So, and, and the, so, and this is, you know, this is, the funny thing, like, you know, like we said, we're, we're, we start big, you know, we're like, let's not just do one series. We're going to end up, you know, we ended up doing well. And like every time, I feel like every time we talk, we talk like another book or another series. And like, I think I, you know, I joked, I'm like, well, we're, we're good through like, I don't know, 2024 or something like that. Like we're, we are, we, we are, so it's. <laughs> We have more planned. I think you're right. I think it's through like 2024 at this I've point. Lost, I've like, lost track. And so our, so Jalen and Leaf, like you said, they'll be out in June um, in the anthology, which I have to say, like, I've not been in the anthology before. So I'm really excited. I'm so happy. Hey, she's in the anthology. I'm so excited because I always get the anthology. <laughs> I'm really excited to be in it. Um, so, um, so that is June. And then we are, so what we're planning is having the first three books of um, our rugby series ready for like a rapid release. Yes. Um, so that will be uh, like the beginning of uh, 2022. Like, I'm almost like, what year are we? Here are we? I know, I know. You know, our book takes place in Philly. There are different places in Philly that they go. Yes. Hopefully, as things get better, that we'll be able to go out and 
take you along with us as we visit these places that our characters have fallen in love with and fallen in love at, which is yeah. not worded well, but they're parts of their uh, their relationship and um, their falling in love journey. So, yeah, yeah. So we will definitely, um, yeah, be making treks to those to those places. Yeah. Once once things settle a little bit, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're really, really excited and we can't wait to introduce these characters to you. Um, we'll be touching base throughout the, the year to kind of give you little um, updates on what we're doing and how yeah. it's going and, um, and, you know, and kind of bring you into our process. So yeah, so um, well, thank you for hanging out with us today in our, I like to call it our cozy corner of the internet. <laughs> and um, we'll see you next time. Thanks so much for joining us. Thank Bye. You. Bye.